The president has the unilateral power to order every single citizen to cover their face in nearly all instances. What other powers does he have? That's why he refused Biden to take questions. He couldn't answer any of them, couldn't answer the questions. He refuses to take questions. He never takes questions. I take questions. He never takes questions. And you sort of wonder what's going on, because they're not that difficult. Some can be nasty, but they're not that difficult. But he never takes questions, so he just, I guess, left. I didn't see it, but I guess he just left the podium. Put it in your minds. My administration has a different approach. We have urged Americans to wear masks. And I emphasized uh, this is a patriotic thing to do. Maybe they're great, and maybe they're just good. Maybe they're not so good. But frankly, uh, what do you have to lose? You have nothing to lose. So we do, and we've uh, been saying wear them when it's appropriate, especially in terms of social distancing, if you can't distance enough. And uh, what do you have to lose? But again, it's up to the governors, and uh, we want to have a certain freedom. And we want to have a certain freedom. That's what we're about. At the same time, we also understand that each state is different and is facing unique circumstances. You have very, very different states fa facing very unique differences and circumstances. We've entrusted the governors of each state, elected by the people, to develop and enforce their own mask policies and other policies, following guidance from the federal government and CDC. We're working with each state to implement a plan based on the facts and science. We will continue to urge Americans to wear masks when they cannot socially distance, but we do not need to bring the full weight of the federal government down on law-abiding Americans to accomplish this goal. Americans must have their freedoms, and I trust the American people and their governors very much. I trust the American people, and the governors want to do the right thing to make the smart decisions. And uh, Joe doesn't. Joe doesn't. Joe doesn't know too much. Unlike the Biden approach, our approach is guided by science. That's why we're focused on protecting the high-risk Americans. That is why we're delivering effective medical treatments to dramatically reduce the fatality rate. And that is why we're developing a vaccine and therapeutics in record time. You'll see that, I think, very soon.